Hi. For the following reactions, determine which species is oxidized and which is reduced. Then we need to indicate which species is the reducing agent and which species is the oxidizing agent. So let's go ahead and look at A. And what we have here is solid magnesium reacting with aqueous HCl, or hydrochloric acid, to produce aqueous magnesium chloride and hydrogen gas. So um, the first thing I need to do here is I need to determine the oxidation numbers of each of the atoms. And it's obvious here that um, we have magnesium solid and this is an elemental state. So the oxidation number for any element in its elemental state is going to be zero. So then let's go over here and determine the oxidation number of the magnesium in the magnesium chloride. And the oxidation number, remember magnesium chloride is ionic, and according to the rules, the oxidation number is going to be the same as the charge on the monatomic ion, in this case for magnesium ion, which would be a plus two. So magnesium has gone from an oxidation number of zero to a plus two. So here we see an increase in the oxidation number, and so that would correspond to an electron loss. So in this case here, magnesium solid has been oxidized. Now, let's take a look at um, the hydrochloric acid. And the oxidation number of hydrogen in hydrochloric acid is going to be a plus one, and a negative one for the chlorine. And when we go over here, uh, we realize that the chlorine has not changed oxidation number because it's a negative one in the magnesium chloride. However, the hydrogen is a plus one here in the hydrochloric acid, and hydrogen gas, uh, this is hydrogen in its elemental state, and it has an oxidation number of zero. So the hydrogen has gone from a plus one to zero, which corresponds to a decrease in charge. So therefore, the electron has been gained. So in this case here, our hydrochloric acid has been reduced. Now, as far as the oxidizing agent, the oxidizing agent, right, is the species that causes reduction. So the oxidizing agent in this case would be the hydrochloric acid, and the reducing agent would be the solid magnesium. So remember, the uh, solid magnesium was oxidized, so therefore the substance oxidized acts as the reducing agent. The hydrochloric acid was reduced, and therefore the substance reduced will act as an, oct as an oxidizing agent. Now let's go to reaction number two, and uh, without even doing um, um, a calculation here um, for oxidation number, I see here, I'm looking at methane and the carbon dioxide. And what we see is an increase in the number of uh, carbon oxygen bonds. And so that corresponds to oxidation. But we can also determine the oxidation numbers as well. So in this case here, um, the oxidation number of carbon would be a negative four. And in this case, it's a positive four. So we see an increase in the charge. So methane is oxidized. And here we have molecular oxygen, which has a zero oxidation number. And oxygen in the carbon dioxide has an oxidation number of a negative two, and also a negative two in the water. 
so we see a decrease in charge so that means oxygen is reduced and in this example then uh, the substance that is reduced acts as the oxidizing agent so oxygen is the oxidizing agent and the methane is the reducing agent so it causes the reduction